mirror was kind of interesting the first time, but if you're just going to stick it around as window dressing, it's going to lose its meaning. Ah, really? Well, that was easy. Alright, well, I will, uh, I will return to cutting for the moment. Or I should say, it's been good talking about this. Nice to have something to actually show in these videos, but uh, yeah, you're not gonna be little. Or you're not going to want to watch the trailing end of this combat and then the ensuing quote-unquote puzzle solving. The proofs are legion. Every creature has a purpose. It is my sacred duty to fit every young person to a calling, be it for ornament or use. Read your history. Read your mythology. Yeah, as expected, the uh, platforming in that section was not especially inspired. Here's a lever. Ah, oh, shoot. Go, uh, go pull lever. That said, it is not simple, necessarily. Oh, shoot! Well, I ran out of jumps already. Ugh. <laughs> Just a note, I actually have not had this much trouble in the things I've been cutting out. I've been cutting them out because they've been ludicrously easy. Oh, phew. Alright. Oh my god, baby! Oh, uh, okay. I will admit that, uh, that scared me for a bit. Just to note, that was the most tedious thing I think I've ever had to do in this game thus far. And considering what I've had to do in this game thus far, holy crap. So, yeah. 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 So check out what this combat is. All of my favorite things. While I'm here, realize I should probably have done this a little bit earlier. Um, let's see what I can upgrade. Let's upgrade the teapot, because that has been quite handy for us recently. Oh, it's pink now. So pretty. And now back to combat. Doctor Wilson's not fooled, Alice. Discipline must be maintained. Cleanliness is optional. Whatever you've imagined about electrical current, it's not a it can be a persuasive teacher, strict mind, demanding. So much wasted imagery. Oh, shoot! Oh, wow, I got lucky there. You're not a cat, my dear. One life is your allotment. Please be more careful with the carving knife. Really? They're just gonna explain away her awesomeness with the Vorpal Butcher's Knife by saying that she screwed around with it as a kid? What is truly sought is most often found, if it is findable. Well, what is the point to anything you say? Like one of those people you grew up respecting and then you find out the bully. I used to think you were so cool. I can't believe you now. Oh no, it's a 
block puzzle. And it's missing half of its pieces. Lovely. I like to imagine the, uh, the, uh, scene where they explained what they were doing with this game. Okay, so, uh, we got American McGee's Alice. Really, you know, really interesting game. What do we do with it? Well, we've got this great story. We've got all these great thematic elements. I think we should put in the most boring, monotonous platforming and combat you've ever seen. Genius. But I think that might get boring after a while. Mm, maybe, maybe you're right. How about... If we took out some of that platforming and instead put in those sliding block puzzles. Kids love those things. Genius again! But even those might get sort of dull after a while. Mm, I think you're right. What's popular with the kids these days? Well, my 20 year old cousin likes those Super Mario games. Alright, what's those got? 3D platforming? Well, we've got that already. Killing enemies? Got that. Get this weird slide segment. Let's add slides. Oh, this has been an option all this time? I knew it was an option for that one kind of puzzle. Didn't know it was there for that. I'll be using that from now on. Wow, really? Not pulling any punches, are you? They fit their name pretty well. There's a tool for every task. Even the humble funnel has a special job. How would you get gin from a barrel into a bottle? That's right, Nurse Witless. Just keep on being one dimensional. Looks like a perfect fit, and I'm a perfect judge. Time to put your new noggin to use. So, now I'm ahead, apparently. Strange. Well, I mean, it's already strange, but now I just don't even really know what's supposed to be going on. Really reminded me of Toy Story, though. Though, I would not complain in the slightest if I was suddenly mounted on a machine with a bunch of, like, spider legs and crab claws. Oh, well. Oof. Man, that'd make this game a lot more fun if I suddenly became, like, Urgot. Um, what am I supposed to do there, then? Do I press up? I guess I press up. That or I get lucky and bounce off the environment. I'm not sure which of those actually did anything for me. Wow. Okay, I think that was supposed to be a puzzle. But, uh, yeah, let's just skip that shit. Hold X. What is... Okay, apparently X is spacebar. Poof. Hooray. So... Breathtaking. Just like the, uh... 
the Asian mural sections. It's like, oh man, this is a kind of a cool concept. What does this have to do with anything? Will it come back after this section? Probably not. It controls really well, actually, once I figured things out. But, okay, what is it? Ah, shoot. I can't jump, so... Yeah, it's it's not impossible to fail, but impossible to screw up, I suppose. I mean, you can fall off the edge, but you just kind of keep moving to the side, and boom! Now it's over. No idea what that had to do with anything, but it's over. Ah, <sighs> this game. A jumble of confusing sometimes good ideas. I don't really care, I got plenty of health right now. So without warning or explanation, this uh, area... <laughs> That's pretty great. Uh, this area has changed from, you know, toy land into a strange, creepy wax doll factory with apparently squid vivisection data on it. Um, yeah, so really not sure what the point of this is, or really what the point of the second section is. This pit part fits uh, a bit more thematically. Oh, jeez. Get me! Get me! Really? I had to press a button to prompt him to say that. Why? Why? The series was going so well during the whole Queen's Castle section. Why did it have to devolve back into me complaining about it all the time? Watch your step. Alice. Again? I, I, I don't understand you, game. Wait, is it? Oh, okay, no, I've just circled around. Okay. That makes a bit more sense. Not that it lets me do that, but that... It made it say the same thing again. So, um... Yeah, this exists. This is a very strange place. So, here we encounter a problem. I have opened up this door and retracted all these spikes, but it leads out to several platforms that are also covered in spikes. Jumping on them kills me, and I see no immediately obvious way to retract those spikes. They used to have a tooth over them, which led me to believe this was some sort of trick, like a test of faith type thing. You go and jump on it and they retract at the last second. But no, they're still killing me. And I've been looping around this section several times to try and see if I can figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do. And I did find a secret door here, which leads nowhere. There were some teeth in here, but nothing else. So I thought maybe I used this section to get up to that higher platform. But there's an invisible wall there. So I am quite, quite confused. Oh! It's not an invisible wall, it's an invisible platform. That's the first one I think of that I haven't been able to actually see anyway. That makes so much more sense now. However, 
Does this actually do anything for me? Gets me up here. And little bits and pieces of head roll around. What? What else? Oh, it's this button. Okay, moving on then.